I done now? Do you know why Robert wasn't here tonight? Sure, because he's smart. I'm not fooling, darling. He's disappeared. That's swell. Now, we can just get Aunt Catherine to disappear. Oh, uh, Nicholas, I'm sorry to take you away from the boys. Oh, that's quite all right. Well, how long has Robert been gone? Three days. Three days without a word. Mm. Have you notified the police? Certainly not. Then we're not going to. Uh, oh, no. Robert may have been kidnapped. He may be lying dead somewhere. But we mustn't do anything about it. Our precious name might get into the papers. Oh, don't pay any attention to her. She's exaggerating the whole affair. However, to please her, I thought you might investigate the matter quietly. With your experience as a... Flatfoot. I didn't mean to be as blunt as that. Well, that's the difference. It's all in family. Have you any idea where he might be? Yes. He's with some woman. I know that. Selma, you know nothing of the sort. What about the vanity case they sent me from that Chinese restaurant? Oh, that was a stupid mistake on their part. Mistake? He's with some woman. You know it. Selma, you know Robert worships you. He wouldn't... How can you say such a thing when you know that he hates me? He only married me for my money. He never did love me. Sometimes I wish he were dead. Well, I'm just a little confused. Do you want him back or don't you? Nick, <gasps> hmm? of course she wants him back. Selma, don't. Please don't. Dear. Now, I leave this in your hands, Nicholas. If you'll excuse me, I'll go back to my guests. Don't worry, darling. It'll be all right. Nick will find him. Well, the one sure way to get him back is to cut off his money. I know. Well, if he doesn't show up before tomorrow morning, I'll go down to the police and see what I can do. Thank you, Nick. Mr. Graham calling, my dad. Ah, oh, David. Hello, how are you, David? Happy New Year. David, how are no, you? No, it's nice to see you. Well, thank heaven you two are back. Yeah. Selma, how are you, dear? Any word yet? Uh, I'll tell you what. What? Let's take David and sneak out. We'll go somewhere and celebrate the New Year. Hey, that's ah. a good idea. How about it, Selma? Well, come on, darling. It'll be like old times when we were all engaged. Yes, before we made any mistakes. What do you mean, mistakes? Oh, uh, I was thinking of Selma. Come on, Selma. Well, thanks. I, I, I want to stay near the telephone, you know, just in case. But, but you go, David. No, not in your life. I'll stay here with you. Well, well then, good night, dear. Try to have a happy New Year. Yes, yes. Happy New Year. Very happy New Year, Summer. Good night, David. Good night. Happy New good night. Year. Come, we'll say goodbye to the family. It will be a pleasure. Look what I found. Iced and everything. Don't you stay here, David. You go out and have some fun. No, don't be silly. We can have fun right here. Oh, what's the matter with me anyway? Why haven't I any pride? Why can't I face it? Robert doesn't give a hang about me. You can't indefinitely go on caring for somebody who doesn't care for you, can you? Well, it's been done. Oh, David, I'm so sorry. I've been such a fool. You really ought to hate me for what I've done to you. Oh, now, don't talk like that. Now, look, you get the glasses, and I'll try to open this no. thing. No. We're going out. This is a new year, the time for resolutions. Well, I'm through with Robert. I mean it. I'm going to get my things. We're going to celebrate. We'll start the new year, right? What is it, Henry? The telephone has it? Uh, uh, no, madame. It's Mrs. Forrest. Uh, she would like you to join her in the drawing room. All right, Henry. Yes. Guess it's no use. Please go, David. Oh, no, so. Oh, I'd rather you did, really. I'll go to bed. Doctor, Dr. Cameron's given me something to make me sleep. Good night, Henry. Good night. Good night. Darling, you will try to find Robert, won't you? I didn't lose him. It'll get you in right with that captain. That's what I'm afraid of. Oh, Nick. Huh? Oh, David, what happened? Well, Selma sent me away. She wouldn't be alone. Oh, I could murder that Robert. Yeah, well, wait till I tell you about the newest thing he pulled on me. He called me up several days ago and told me if I gave him $25,000, he'd clear out and leave Selma for me. Lovely boy. What did you say? Well, I didn't know exactly what to say. I asked him to give me several days to think it over. Well, 25000 is cheap if you'll really go. Well, why don't you get up a collection? I know a lot of people would be glad to contribute. Poor girl, 